What's going on YouTube? Welcome into we get an absolute beautiful build for you. Today we're building for AlphaTube. If you don't know who AlphaTube is, he's done a lot of things in the community, from his BitBot interactions to probably getting shot in the face here by a ping pong launcher. Ping pong, ping pong ball launcher? Yeah, he, he's done it. He started this trend here in the community. A lot of creators are doing it. AlphaTube's an amazing, amazing Stinspo partner as well. And we're excited to build this beautiful PC for him today. 14900K, 4080 Super, 64 gigs of uh, DDR5 RAM. We have six terabytes of NVMe storage going into today's drive. We're putting, or into today's system. We're putting it all in the beautiful H7 RGB flow coming from NZXT. And then we're cooling it with the Lean, uh, Lean Lee Galahad 2 Trinity. Absolutely beautiful system. Make sure to let us know what you think down below in the comments. Make sure to that like button as well. Make sure to subscribe button if you want to see more beautiful PCs like, PCs like this built over here on YouTube. And if you want to catch us raw, unedited, live, live like it is right now, as I butcher intros like these, you can join us any Monday, Wednesday, or Friday over at Twitch channel at twitch.tv slash dins at 10 a.m. Eastern. We hope to see you soon. All right, let's get everything down off the top here. Uh, stream is free. We, we build Whack Your Bush. We, we build on stream for free, dude. We don't, we don't pay to be built on stream. You might have, like, delay, like, a couple days sometimes, but no, it's, there's no, there's no build, like, build on stream added fee. People have talked about it. I just don't do that. All right, let's get our, our CPU down in the socket here. Today's motherboard is the Z790 Tomahawk from MSI. Socket looks good. Drop this 1400K down in the socket. There we go. Let's get our drives in. First gonna be our two terabyte KC3000, our four terabyte Renegade drive. We're from Kingston. Right now the KC3000 drive is a little out of stock when it comes to um, the four terabytes. So we've been upgrading some people to the Renegade drives, which is it's a more high performance gaming drive. Really, it's got, it's got DRAM just like the KC3000. It's really, honestly, almost the same drive, just rebranded into a gaming kind of theme. The read-write is very comparable. When you look at the drives right now, like the top four drives really in this space from reliability and brand standpoints are the 990 Pros, the 850Xs, and like the KC3000s and the Renegades. Those are like, they're all very comparable in terms of performance. It just depends on what brand new. So we have a really good relationship with Kingston. We have the product locally in warehouse. We use a lot of Kingston product. Down here we go with the KC3000, two terabyte drive, primary drive. There we go. Next is going to be our, our secondary drive, which we put down here. Four terabyte theory drive going down and in. There we go. Get our 1700 brackets installed before we put a RAM in. Dude, this one was being funky. There we go. Be careful on that board. I don't want to go through. We're through now. All right. Yeah, that the, uh, the the optimized process on our website is absolutely killer. In terms of overall performance, I would say it's like our top, I'd say our top performing bank for buck system. I think after that, it'd probably go to the signature the signature elite, which is the 14.6 and the 40.70 super. I think that falls right behind it. And then I would say after that, I'd probably go to the uh, optimized elite, the 14.7 and the 40.80, because I think that's a really really good value as well. Um, and then the ultimate is just expensive because the 40.90 right now is just so so over. It's like super expensive. We get a ram out next. There we go, those are beautiful rip jaws, 64 gigabytes of 6400 megahertz serial 32. Beautiful kit. Travis D's got the same kit in his system. Beautiful S5. There we go. Looking great. Get today's case out chat, the beautiful H7 Flow RGB. Give me that front close up. That beautiful H7 Flow RGB. I'm gonna try to get him a rear RGB fan. Let me look really quick, chat. Let's see what I can get for him. Give me a second. A little deep cool RGB fan. Let's go top down. Get this motherboard in chat. There we go. All right, let's get our screws that we need. Our motherboard's all secure. Let's get ready to work on the rear fan and all the front panel connections. Let's get the rear fan in. A nice little uh, DF120 from Deepcool. It's just a standard PWM fan for the rear, the RGB. They put all, they zip tie all these together and I don't really like the way they manage it. So we're gonna clip the Factory zip ties here, run the front panel connections, and then we work on the cabling. First we have our USB-C and our Type-3. There's our USB 3.0 header. There we are in. Next we are Type-C. There it is, all in. Get our front panel connection in. Our front panel connections, this will be our power switch, our power LED, all the goodies. All right, let's get our RGB as well as our PWM set up as well. And we'll zip tie these cables out of the way. I mean, unless you want like a Gen 5 NDV drive, which they're super overpriced and they're re realistic that you're gonna actually experience anything different in terms of speed that's noticeable in gaming is negligent. So you're paying, you're paying a lot more for that. So we don't use a lot of X670E boards or B650E boards because the, um, 
Gen 5 speed and price just isn't really valuable yet, in my opinion. Here, before we move on to our power supply chat. Power supply today, 1200 watt beauty from Asus. Look at this beautiful power supply out. Tough power supply from Asus today. We'll need a SATA, it's gonna power our cooler later. Got our PCIe, which we do not need. 24 pin main motherboard, CPU one and CPU two. There we go, all these other cables will go in the box. Beautiful braided cables that come with these power supplies from Asus, absolutely stunning. There we go. It's our power supply, let's get this in. Let's slide this in and get it, zip, or get it all screwed in. It's our last onboard cable to run, which is our HD audio for the front cables, or our front connections for HD audio. All in, 24 pin main motherboard going up and next. All in there. He was looking good on the back. Let's see here, now we start working on the cooler. Looking good. Start working on our cooler chat. This beautiful Galahad 2. All good to go there. That's our cooler. Let's start working on getting this mounted chat. So I'm gonna do is lay this down, get our thermal paste applied. We're gonna apply the cooler pump head. All right. I'm slightly, slightly just hitting him really quick. I'm not, I'm not tightening with this. I'm just getting him kind of in to hold in place before you hand tighten. All right, all in, looking good. All right, let's just pick this up slightly. So we're gonna start working on our cable management. I'll give you guys a real cable management view really quick. There we go there with the cooler. There we go, two are in, there we go. All right, I'm gonna give you a front close up now. I'm gonna work on the wiring. Put the top back on. Here we put the GPU in chat. We got an absolute monster today. Absolute monster of a GPU, the expert is in the house. The 4080, 4080 Super Expert today from MSI. Sheesh! It's absolute chunker. Chonker chungus. Look at me, look at this thing, dude. Oh my, I mean, look, I'm, I'm absolutely just bricked up looking at this thing. Look at that. And let's get our three slots we need out for this chungus. It's a push pull, yeah, it, push, it pushes and pulls uh, across the rat. Actually one of the most efficient coolers. And obviously the car just looks actually spectacular. It's not like this RGB gaudy thing that some of the other one brands are doing right now. It looks really, really good. It's really powerful too. So it's a, uh, it would get these to our customers for a really good price and a really reliable MSI card. So we take this and the Supreme are their top, top tier cards right now. And we're putting them in our customer, our sisters, our customer systems right now. So it's, they're getting big, big upgrades. And we go with this Chungus. You guys ready to hear this? Three, two, one. Never heard that. What do you guys think? That's a beauty or what? That's an absolute beauty. You guys ready to light this bad boy up? Guys, thanks for coming in and liking another video here on YouTube. Make sure to hit that like button to help us with the algorithm. Make sure people find us and see all the beautiful PCs we build. If you haven't subscribed already, hit that subscribe button as well. Remember, we build these systems live every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday over on our Twitch channel at twitch.tv stints. Come over, hang out, chat it up with us, watch us build beautiful PCs for everybody in the community. And remember, let's go.